Hello everyone, this is Linda and today is Shout Out Monday. I hope you guys had a great weekend. I had a very interesting weekend uh, with the rain and the water and you know, but I made it through and uh, now the sun is shining. It's looking really pretty out there. <laughs> But anyway, guys, I hope you all had a great weekend as well. I planted my garlic yesterday, so hey, it's in the ground. So today, I want to give a, I just want to highlight 10 of my subscribers and let them know how much I appreciate them. You know, everyone likes to know that they are appreciated at some time. So today we're going to highlight 10. All right. So my number one shout out today is in, I'm sorry, J and N T V. That's J and N T V. And this is a cooking channel. And this young lady cooks some very delicious looking dishes. Very, very good. I know if you all go over and check her out, uh, you all are going to enjoy it. And while you're over there, tell her that the New Orleans Garden is sent you, okay? Number two is London Worms and Garden. Yeah, you know, sometimes I get a little squeamish when I'm looking at the worms, but I do know as a gardener, the beneficials of having uh, worms in my garden. He just did a video with his granddaughter. They harvest some beautiful cucumbers and she was just the cutest. So go and check out London Worms and Garden. Number three is Little Beans Garden. Little Beans Garden is a beautiful young lady. She have a wonderful garden. Uh, she says she have been trying to um, uh, video this hummingbird that visits her yard. And finally, finally, she got it. <laughs> and she shared it with us. And it was very beautiful. So you all go and check out Little Bean's Garden and tell her that I sent you, okay? My next channel, number four, is the number two dogs two dogs he is an awesome gardener he just had one of the greatest harvests of watermelon i ever seen uh i think he was just as shocked as as anybody else was because he was beginning to ask what did i do i don't know what i did <laughs> i'm like repeat what you did and you know and you're going to do great, you know. He had such a great harvest of watermelons. It was beautiful. So uh, go check out Two Dogs, all right, and tell him I sent you there. Number five is Krista's Garden. Krista's Garden is a young lady. She have a beautiful garden, and oh, my God, the vegetables this young lady grows is absolutely beautiful. She have a wonderful garden. So uh, she have beautiful flowers, you know, and you know I'm loving that one. So you all go and check out Krista's garden. It's really, really beautiful. Now I'm going to try my best to link all of these channels, but if they are not linked, I am going to put their names in the description box. I'm going to do my best, okay? All right, number six is the Orlando Gardener. Now, uh, Orlando Gardener and I have just become, um, he just subscribed to my channel, and I have been enjoying his channel a lot. Now, he grows some um, peppers, but the majority of his garden is mangoes. I believe this young man has every type of mango I've ever seen. Uh, and they are beautiful and healthy. And they are dwarf trees. They are small trees and the fruits are just huge. 
uh, and he does some taste testing. So go check out Orlando Gardner. Number seven is Blessed Farms. Blessed Farms is a wife and husband team. Oh, excuse me. It's a wife and husband team, and they have um, their home in Texas, and they have chickens and a uh, huge garden. He did a video on the harvest of his sunflower seeds, but he also put a video out it is called um, Story Time in the Garden. It was a beautiful story. I loved it. Absolutely love it. And as a matter of fact, I'm going to tell it to Jada and Jading today. And I'll see what they say about that bear and the chipmunk. Yeah. Very cool story. Go check them out. That is Blessed Farms. Number eight. Now I'm going to spell the last name of this person's channel because I cannot pronounce it. But her first name is Pat. And the last name is N-C-U-B-E. Yeah, you know, she pronounced it one time for us because it is an African name. But from what I, think, uh, from what I understand, she said it was um, a sound. So, uh, no, I'm not going to try. I'm going to spell it. Miss Pat have a beautiful garden. Absolutely beautiful. She have a tree over there, uh, and she don't know the name of the fruit. So, I was trying to do some research. It looked like a sugar apple tree, maybe. But uh, you all go over there and see. Maybe you all know what kind of tree that is. But it's it have lots of fruits on it, too. That's the wonderful thing. It, uh, and so her name is Pat N-C-U-B-E. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not going to try. <laughs> Number nine is the Misfit Gardening. Misfit Gardening is so wonderful. She grow organically. She used by using her leaves and her grass clippings. And she just, she and her husband just did a taste test with Stobart tomatoes and the tomatoes that they grew in the yard. Now, one of the t tomatoes that they grew was a Cherokee purple. And he was blindfolded and he chose that tomato as the best one. So go and check out Misfit Gardening. My number 10 is Ellen's Home Delight. Ellen is a beautiful person, and uh, she cooks just as sweet as she is. She cooks, oh my God, beautiful uh, pies and cakes and, uh, and main dishes. Also, she has some beautiful recipes that is just absolutely, it looks so delicious. Matter of fact, when I look at them a lot, I get hungry, you know? <laughs> But that is Ellen's Homemade Delight. Now, you guys, I'm going to list them all in the description box. And when you go over and check their channel out, go ahead on and subscribe and tell them that the New Orleans Garden sent you there. And I know that they will subscribe back to you and you all can support each other. All right, guys, I hope you all have a great, great Monday. I'm enjoying myself today because I'm with my three favorite people in the whole world, you know, Joshua, Jaden, and Jada. <laughs> Matter of fact, I just finished eating, so I'm full as a tick, you know. <laughs> but I hope you guys have a great Monday. All right, and I'll see you guys later. Later, y'all.